Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. The Florida Athletic Coaches Association, Polk County Public Schools, and Central Florida Sports welcome you to the Furnace, home of Southeastern University Fire for the 2024 FACA Boys Basketball All-Star Classic. Today's game, we're going to be live streamed on YouTube on Quickie Cuts Video. If you guys are wanting any photos today, please make sure to see Andre Lott. He will be taking photos all day. The FACA reminds you that interscholastic events are an extension of the classroom and that lessons are best learned with proper respect is accorded to all. Please let your good sportsmanship show as you watch today's game. Now, today we're going to have a contest between the North All-Stars and the South All-Stars. Let's go ahead and announce those players. For the North All-Stars, coming in at guard at number 10 from Pensacola Washington High School, Alex Jasquith. Guard, number 12, from Jasquick Hall High School, Caleb Williams. Guard, number 13, from Oviedo High School, number 13, Alex Harper. Guard, number 14, from the Villagers High School, Benjamin Kobeck. Four, number 15, from Wilson High School, Kyler Lamb. Guard, number 20, from Rock College High School, Kyan Blount. Center, number 21, from Nice High School, Jack Sullivan. Forward, number 22, from Mr. Dora Christian High School, Javier Ruel. The head coach is DJ Lowes from the Villages High School. And now for your South All-Stars, number 10, guard from Tampa Leader High School, Daniel Delgado III. Guard, number 11, from Tampa Leader High School, Derek Delgado Jr. Guard number 12 from Treasure Coast High School, Tyson Wilson. Guard number 13 from Victory Christian High School, Lorenzo Cassidy. Guard number 14 from Palmetto Ridge High School, Calvin Charles. Guard number 15 from Gilbert Prep High School, Jovian Cardoza. Ford number 25 from Northport High School, Elijah Lumsey. And number 12 from Jesuit High School, Nate Boyan. Coach is Stephen Lee Fitzgerald from Victory Christian High School. Now everyone, please rise as we have our national anthem. Southeastern University is the FACA All-Star Classic, and you're watching it right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. Appreciate you guys tuning in. I'm Adam Black. Now it's the boys North versus South High School All-Star Basketball game. We've got some of the best athletes come from all around the state. They can come to Lakeland to play one more game in their high school basketball career. Just like that, we are underway from Lakeland and Southeastern University. It's the furnace here on the campus of Southeastern.
Played two 20-minute halves here for the boys' side of things. That one smacked away inside by Lubzy. Here's Delgado. Delgado with the layup, can't connect. Lamb for three, and he's got it. First points of the game will go to Kyler Lamb in the north. And right back with the three of his own is Lorenzo Kaysen. Williams contested in the lane, he'll be fouled. In Quebec, off the inbound from Williams. Nice move, fade away for two. And right back at you, says Derek Delgado Jr. And we're tied at five. The Delgado brothers playing with each other today on the South team. And that shot is off. Rebounded by Williams, and Williams takes it up for the North. Nice move, just rolls off the iron. And here's Williams again. He's looking back door, but that won't be smacked away. Here's Lamb for three. Got to go. Long three point here, and it rolls in. Lorenzo Kaysen with another. That was a two there by Lamb, won't connect. And back the other way is Case in the alley, he can't finish. South looking to get flashy here in the All-Star game. Three ball out of Blunt. That one won't fall. Nice little step back there from Case, and that one can't connect, it appears that. Lamb got a piece of it, and Lamb will finish at the other end for two. 10 to 8 the score here. That shot is off. Across the court, here's Harper. That one's short. Rebounded by Blunt outside Quebec. Williams for three, and he's got it. Caleb Williams, no, not the USC Caleb Williams, the Rebault High School Caleb Williams for three. And Boyake looking for finish, but he's fouled on the way up, and he'll shoot two. under four minutes into the game here, 13 to eight the score. And now 13 to nine the score as Boyake knocks down his first free throw. Knocks down the second, it's a three point game. Williams inside the lane, but that one stripped away. And a long pass here. And that one's going to be stolen by Ryan Blunt. The back-to-back -back steals here for both teams. And as Quebec's pass was batted out of bounds. Out of bounds, blue ball.
And that one going to be stolen away on the fast with Brocky. And off the glass and rolls in for two. It's going to make it a one-point lead now for the North. Williams, that's a three. And he cashes in once again. 16 to 12 now the score. 15 20 left to play in the first half. Inside. Can't finish. Was looking for Lubsey there. And that one going to be stripped away by Kaysen. Kaysen outside. And Baca is going to be blocked but fouled by Ryan Blunt. Boykin knocked down his first two earlier. And knocked down his third. Checking into the game for the North, Javier Raul and Jack Sullivan. As well as for the South, Julian Cardoza. And Boykin's four for four from the line to start this game. Here's Blunt. And was looking back door, but that one gonna be tipped. It'll find its way back to Williams. Long three-point here for Williams, and he cashes in again. Delgado to Charles. Charles just checking the game a little bit ago. He'll miss that one. And here's Williams again with it. Williams outside. Blunt for three, and he's got it. 22 to 14 to score. And three ball off the front iron there. And a lob there to Sullivan, excuse me, Blunt. He'll collect it, he'll shoot a three. That one off the iron. And back the other way we go. Boyke outside. Here's Cardozo with his first action today. And Cardozo with a nice little floater and it'll drop in for two. Williams, step back, three ball off the back iron, almost had another one. And Kaysen, nice move there, backdoor Delgado, out into the corner. Three ball rolls off the rim for Charles. Here's Delgado from the corner, he can't cash in. Pass there to Harper, and now here's Arella Ruel with his first action. There's Sullivan. That one rolls off the rim. Boyke, easy shot for two. 22 to 18, 12 20 left in the first. And nice move there by Ruel. Can he finish? He can. Six-point lead for the North. Wookie inside. Charles with the finish. Has to put 20 on the board now for the South. Here's Harper in the corner. Three rolls off the iron. Delgado. 
Kaysen. Drives the lane, can't finish. Tested lane there. Here's Blunt. Blunt's fouled on the way up, and that one just rolls out. And Ryan Blunt will take his first trip to the free throw line today. Getting 80% on this season from the line. That one just off the back of the rim. And he'll knock down the second. As Kyler Lamb checks back into the game for the North. Here's Derek Delgado. The Delgado's brothers playing here on the south. And nice layup there from Kaysen. I put it back to a three-point game. Lamb in the corner, and he's got it. Driving is Charles. Charles, nice shot, and it'll roll in for two. And that one going to be stripped away by Charles. And taken right back by Williams. Williams pass up to Lamb. Lamb can't finish, but Sullivan can. And nice finish there by Kaysen. Williams mid-rager off the front of the rim. Finds his way into the hands of Delgado. Delgado, nice mid-ranger, can't fall. And a rebound by Cardoza. He'll put it in for two. Left-handed shot you saw there of Cardoza. That quick turnaround. That's a three, that won't fall. Rowell floats that one up, that one won't fall either. Here's Case in the, off the rebound. Nice move to the rim, tries to throw it down. He can't, but he will go to the line. Pacing the guard out of Victory Christian Academy right here in Lakeland, Florida. Misses that first shot. Averaging 24 and a half points on the season. And the 6'3 guard tries to throw it down as he misses his second free throw. And it's a nice layup there for Jesquith. He looked like he wanted to dunk it. Cardoza, that's a three ball. That one won't fall into the hands of Sullivan. Here's Raul to take it up. Corner three, can't connect. And Cardoza finds Kaysen. Kaysen into the corner for Delgado. Delgado can't make it. And kept alive, no. Charles trying to keep it alive, but ends up rolling off the backboard. 32-28 game here, North leads it. And here's Sullivan now. 6'10", center, and his pass is off the target. Here's Boyke. Step back inside the Delgado. 
And up and under goes Delgado Jr. off the assist from Danny Delgado. Now looking at a two-point game. And the Derrick and Danny get Delgado connection early here in the first half. And nice shot there for two out of Quebec. That's a long three off the front iron by Lovesy. Inside, Quebec with the finish. Now push to a six point lead now for the North. And nice finish, count the basket for Nate Boyke. Boyke 0 for 1 earlier, his last free throw attempt. And he'll knock in that one. Three point play for Nate Boyke. 36 to 33. And outside corner three won't go from Sullivan. Lamb now with it, and he'll lose the ball. And they're going to call North possession here. Well, Might have caught a fingertip of Boyke. Sullivan. Here's Quebec now, driving the lane, outside. That was just just skiff there. Jasquith, excuse me. And he'll inbound it following the foul. And there's Sullivan again. Roll a wide open three. Can't sink it. Cardoza outside, finds Wilson. Shooting out Boyke. The Garden out with it. Nice move, but can't finish the shot. That one rolls off the rim. And a pass way out by Roll. As Harper and Blunt check back into the game, for the North. The Garda with the lob was looking for his brother, but they can't connect. And long past the Harper, that one falls out of bounds. The Delgado brothers coached by their dad, Daniel Delgado, at Lido High School in Tampa. Cardoza outside to Delgado. Now Boyke. Boyke shoots, can't connect, no foul. And Blunt. We'll find Harper in the backcourt. Here's just with now. That one going to be stolen by Cardoza. Cardoza trying to do the fancy layup there. Can't fall. Put back no good. And into the hands of Harper. Harper mid-ranger. That will connect. And the South will take a timeout. 38, 33 your score. 519 to play here in the first half. Back in a moment right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network.
Welcome back in. This is where five to play here in the first half. Delgado in the corner. Swish. Three ball, and that's going to make it a two-point game. Beck now with it. He'll lose it. And up there for Boyke. And he's going to be blocked by Sullivan, and the putback is no good. And the North will take a timeout. And Caleb Williams going to Lafayette Patriot League next year. And then we got two University of Tampa commits in Kyler Lamb and Ryan Blunt. Nine points so far, and Lamb has 11, and the leaders for the South is Boyke with 11, and Kaysen with 10. Like a couple of nice three balls and nice finishes. Harper finds Nicholson. Jimmy Williams. And he'll end up losing the ball, and we'll see the South again. Boyke, step back three. He's got it. That's going to leave the South their first lead of the game. Williams trying to answer. Finds Blunt. Inside, Quebec. Can't finish. Tries to steal it back. A nice pass there to Charles. Charles is going to be blocked by Sullivan. But he'll end up getting called for a foul, and Charles will see the free throw line. Foul, number 21, 14, shooting two. Second trip to the line today. Missed that first one. And that'll knock in off the backboard for the second free throw. And at 40 to 38 now the score. The South just now taking the lead. A nice floater there out of Williams. He'll cash in. And we're tied at 40. Kaysen keeps it alive, but Williams will come out with it. Inside, looks looking for Sullivan, but that'll trickle out of bounds. Out of bounds, blue ball. And inside, nice move there, and nice finish by Harper. North will take the lead back. 3.20 left to play in the first half. Nice move there. And another finish off the glass for Boyke. And now we're back tied at 42. There's Williams again. And nice move, step back three. And rolls off and in. Caleb Williams having himself a game. As Kaysen in traffic can't finish. And Quebec, no, finds Blunt. Blunt gonna be blocked. Up there, Delgado lobs it up, can't finish. But he'll get the put back is Kaysen. Still looking to see an oop in this game. Just over two minutes left in the first half. Outside of Quebec. 
And Quebec, nice finish in traffic. Outside. Three ball won't go. That was Kaysen on the shot. And that one going to be stolen away by Delgado. And Boyke with the two-hand jam. One-point game, 47-46. And there's another three out of Williams. That's going to put the North at 50. And a three from Delgado. That one off the, the backboard into the hands of Williams again. Outside, Blunt, he's got it. Three-pointer for Blunt, 53 to 46 to score in the final minute of the first half. As Boyke was looking for Charles there as he was contested in the lane. And timeout taken by the North. 40 seconds left in the first half. We'll see you in a second. Back in a moment right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. Back in, 40 seconds left here in the first half. Caleb Williams has five threes in this first half, 17 points on the other side. Boyke has 18 points. And we're looking at a seven point ball game. Here's Williams with the lane and the finish. 55 on the board for the North. Delgado going to drive the lane himself. He'll lay, lay that one up and in for two. 15 to play in the first. Quebec. Fade away. Won't fall. That's going to put an end to this first half of action here at the FACA All-Star Classic. You're watching the Quick Cut Sports Network.
Welcome back in to the second half of action here from Southeastern University. It's the FACA All-Star Classic, and you're watching it right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. William leads it for the North with 19 points in the game. There's a three out of the Delgado, and he connects. Williams looking for somewhere to go with it. Finds Harper. Inside. Nice shot there to Lamb, but it won't fall. Williams, another deep three. Rolls the iron. And kept alive. Dished inside the Lamb, and Lamb will finish for two. Boyke down the baseline and up and under. Nice layup there. And right back to a two point game. Williams to the rim, can't finish. Now Boyke the other way. Delgado, three pointer won't fall. Dangerous pass there, but it's collected by Williams. That's a three, and off the glass and in for Quebec. And there's a three right back there for Delgado. That being Danny Delgado. Like I said earlier, playing with his brother Derek Delgado in this game. And long three off the back iron. And tipped and rebounded by Kaysen. Inside of Delgado for two. And now we're tied at 60 apiece here in the second half, just two minutes in. And Lamb, nice finish off the glass. And interesting move there, but Gazin ends up losing it. Here's Williams now. Pass up to Harper. Harper knocks that one down. 64 on the board for the North. There's Lubsey for three. And a deep pass there to Quebec. Quebec can't finish up the wide open. Wide open pass, and Blunt has to put it in. And Delgado to the rim for two. Williams finds Quebec outside. Three ball is good by Blunt. Delgado is going to be stripped away by Blunt. That one nearly smacked away. And Blunt put that one in to put the North over 70. Boyke driving the lane, kicks it out. Lubsey, three ball, cashes in. 71 to 65, the score. Down the baseline, and a one hand jam from Lamb. A nice move there from Kaysen to cash in for two. 73 to 67, the score now. The North still leads it. Outside, Lamb. Three ball won't go. Rebounded by Delgado. 
Kaysen, Delgado, up and under. It won't fall. That one tipped away, but a nice pass there, and up and under. And Blunt is fouled on the way up. He'll shoot two. Blunt, one for two is last time from the line today. Eight percent on the season from the free throw line. He'll knock down the second. 74-67 the score as we are five minutes into the second half. And Charles finds a lane in a nice finish. Puts the score at 69 for the South. Williams in the corner inside the blunt. And fade away. Cash is in. Ryan Blunt, nice shot. Blunt averaging just under 28 points a game this season. And we're going to see Boyke to the line here. Knocks down his first in the South half 70. Three shots, three points for Boyke. And Blunt, guarded heavily, passes out to Williams. Williams, that ball knocked away. Oh, he's got 23 points in the game. 76-72 score. Must be Lamb to inbound it. We'll find Rowell. His first action in the second half. Nice move there. Can't finish, though. And going the other way is Charles. Delgado for three. Off the front iron. The squith going the other way with it. Lamb, baseline, nice finish. And up and under there for Boyke, but he's fouled. Boyke right back to the free throw line. Knocked down three or three last time. And knocks down another. Two more for Boyke. Bro, that one going to be stripped away and a foul called.
land. That one's going to be stolen. Here's Cardoza now. Outside Delgado. Back to Cardoza. And dished inside to Boyke. Boyke will lose it. But possession will stay with the South. Delgado, catch and shoot three, no good. There's Rowe directing traffic. That one off the rim. Cardoza the other way with it. Delgado to his brother. And nice spin move and a nice finish there for Derek Delgado. Tyler Lamb looking for something to do. Drives the lane. Offhand, no good. Up there to Delgado. Delgado, nice lay off the glass. And we're looking at a one-point game. And timeout called here. We'll take one with them back in a moment right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. back in. Just over 12 left to play in the game. It's a correction left scoreboard, 78. We are tied at 78 apiece here in the FACA. All-Star Classic right here from Lakeland, Florida. And that one will roll in there for Sullivan. It's been moved step back there for Case, and that one won't fall. Lamb now going to be stripped away by Charles. And Case with the finish. And tied at 80. That one up to Lamb. Back to roll. And just with cash is in from three point range. And another quick two right back there for the South. And off the glass, can't finish. And Delgado now in the corner. Quick little fake, and that's going to put the South ahead. That's a three out of Harper, and he cashes in. 86-84 the score. Just over 10 left. And Delgado gets the ball back, but can't knock down the three. Here's Sullivan. Sullivan, nice move. That one won't fall. Into the hands of Kaysen. Under 10 to go here in the second half. And that one. Poked into the hands. Here's Harper. 
Harper up and under. That one won't fall. Put back by Sullivan. That one won't go either. Cardoza lobbing. Nobody's home for the pass from Kaysen. As Williams and Quebec will check back into the game for the North. Two-point game here at the Furnace on Southeastern University's campus. Williams to the basket. And block there called on Cardoza. And Williams will go to the line. We'll knock in his first. He's got 20 now on the game. <laughs> Williams, 82% from the line this past season as he cashes in again. And four point lead now for the North. Borky, step back, sinks it in. And the go for two, that's gonna make it a two point game again. North still leading it with Williams up the other end of the court. Williams, nice move but can't finish. And going the other way with it is Boyke. Boyke off the glass for the finish. And we're tied at 88 apiece. And that's a three that's going to get stuck in the rim from Quebec. And that's still going to be possession for the North. Just over eight to play here in the FACA Boys All-Star Classic. He was just quick with it. Step back, three, won't go. Rebound by Cardoza. Cardoza with a three off the front iron. There's Williams now. Drives, finds the corner, now the arc for Harper, and he cashes in. Boyke looking to make a three. That one won't fall. Here's Harper again. Harper coast to coast and a foul. Harper's got himself a couple threes. And his first trip of the line, he'll make his first. 77% on the season from the line here for Harper. And that second one gonna roll out. And rebound taken here by Kaysen. And the ollie and can't finish, but Kaysen will put it in for two. Harper again now. Finds Blunt inside. Come back. And that one nearly lost by Chesquith, but he gets it back. Here's Quebec again. Oh, 
And Quebec loses it, but gets it back. And the putback is good by Jasquith. And 94 for the North. As Kaysen can't cash in. Speaking of Kaysen, just got word that he's committed to FAU, Florida Atlantic University. And back and forth there for Harper and Williams. And Williams with a nice finish. And Boyke, count the basket. He's got an and one. Six minutes to play here from Lakeland. And Volke will knock down the three-point play. And Kyler Lamb checking back into the game for the North. In the corner now for Quebec. Quebec, nice move. Guard it tightly. Turnaround jumper, no good. Rebounded by Lubsey. And Boyke to the rim for two. One point game with five left to play here from Lakin. Three ball. Cash is in. That's Ryan Blunt. Kaysen driving now. Turn around jumper, he's got it. Ninety-nine to ninety-seven. As we hit the final five minutes in the game, Williams. Outside blunt. Three-pointer. Sinks it in. And we've got over a hundred here in the All-Star game. 102 for the North. There's a spin, but he is going to be rejected by Lamb. Up the other way is Williams. Outside. Blunt. Won't go. And the rebound and put back is good by Harper. Outside. Lovesy. Three ball, nothing but net. That's going to break the 100-point mark for the South. Timeout taken. We'll take one with them. Back in a moment right here on the Quick Cut Sports. Back in, 4-11 left to play here. And Blunt and Williams tied at 23 for the, the point leaders on the north, followed by Lamb with 19. And for the south, Nate Boyke has 34 points in the game, followed by Kaysen with 20. Williams off the screen. Lamb going to be poked away. And still north ball is that one. Caught the referee. Okay. 
Williams. He'll drive the lane. Long shot there. That one won't fall. Gets his rebound. And that one off of Delgado. And still possession for the North. And Blunt can't finish, but the touching no good again by Blunt. And he'll get called for a foul during that. Boyke will let it roll past midcourt. And he's going to be stripped away by Blunt. But right back into the hands of the South and Kaysen. And Kaysen fouled on the way up. He'll go to the line for two. That one rolls in for his first free throw. 101 on the board for the South. 104 still for the North. And a two for two for that trip. And back to a two point game. Under three to play. And the putback will go in there for Blunt. And full timeout coming here. Yeah. We'll step aside and we will rejoin you for the, time, for the final 250 right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. Two fifty left on the clock here from Blakeland in the NFCA, excuse me, FACA All Star Classic, right here on the Quick Cut Sports Network. Blunt's got twenty five now in the game. Hayson nearly, nearly loses it. He'll keep driving, and that one will bounce off and in. For a quick two. Williams in the corner, finds Lamb for three. Boyke now. You know, float that one up for two. 106 to 109. Our score, two minutes left to play. Outside, that's Blunt. Sinks it in. 112 on the board for the North as they take another timeout. We'll keep it here. As Blunt, 28 points now on the game. Caleb Williams still at 23. And the other side, Nate Boyke now at 36 points in this game. Kaysen has 24. Following a couple of another nice shots there. Minute 49 officially here on the clock. Here at the furnace on the campus of Southeastern University. I'd like to thank them for hosting this event. And 
all of these seniors get to play one last game here before they start their college careers. And Williams gets called there. Minute 46 on the clock. That's a three off the front iron. And Blunt will get the rebound. And Williams is fouled. As Cardoza will check back into the game. Minute 22 less on the clock. 23 will call it. <laughs> Tight defense here. Inside in the finish for Harper. And Delgado for three. Five-point game with 104 left on the clock. Delgado's got two threes here today. Boyke leading the game still with 36 points. Kaysen sitting at his season average 24. Nice play out the Delgado brothers as well. They were looking to connect on an alley-oop early in the game, weren't able to do so. Final minute to play, Williams has a lane, and off the glass, he'll finish count the basket, he's going to the line. So officially 51 seconds left on the clock. And Williams, free throw off the back iron. And that one smacked away, but into the hands of Boyke. Delgado, three balls, no good, off the front of the rim. And long pass here to Williams. Three from the corner, he's got it. That's a three from Boyke. That one's no good, rebounded by Lamb. And throwing it down is Ryan Blunt. And the North breaks the 120 point mark. And Delgado will throw it down. And that is going to do it here from Lakeland. Your final score, the North 121, the South 111. The FACA All-Star Classic. So I always like to give a good congratulations to these young men and their efforts here today in the All-Star game.
So Ryan Blunt ends up leading the score sheet for the North with 30 on the game, followed by Williams at 28 and 22 for Lamb. And on the other side, 36 for Nate Boyke. He's had himself a game. 24 for Kaysen and Derek Delgado with 20. And I think that right there is the definition of an all-star game. That's going to do it for our coverage here at the FACA All-Star Classic. I'm Adam Black. Thank you guys for tuning in. We'll see you next time. So long from Lakeland and here on the Quick Cut Sports Network.